Hi everyone, in this short video I just want to show you what GNU Parallel can do for you if you use a for loop to process multiple files in the command line. So right now I'm just going to run this command uh, with the data on either side and there's the command adding these CSV files into uh, my Postgres database. So I'm just going to run that command now. If you have a multi-core system you can really speed up the processing uh, by using uh, GNU Parallel. Uh, the command with the for loop should take around 20 seconds or so and if you're looking at doing a lot more files or data you could really see the benefit of using something like GNU Parallel to actually process your files. As you can see there it took 20 seconds to process that with the for loop. Now I'm just going to plop in a command with Parallel. So now you can see we got parallel the <coughs> command to be run there. Uh, that's just a command I'm passing into that script. And there's your uh, variables, and there you can see I'm looking for anything dot import files. I'm going to run that quickly, and then we can see I think it should take around five seconds. And as you can see, well, in fact, there it took three seconds, so there's quite a lot faster. Uh, so you're looking at a time of 20 seconds as opposed to 3 seconds so you look at a factor of over 6 in the improvements there which is what I saw when I have also have a script that processes those files from uh, the original into that import file and there I looked at an improvement from 1 hour 39 minutes into just 15 minutes so that was also a factor of just over six and just to show you an example of that command here I'm looking for CSV files uh, that script is running and then I'm outputting it to a file with the original file name with the dot import uh, uh, file extension okay so I will post more videos to show more in-depth use of the GNU parallel command but I think this can give you a good idea of how it can actually uh, reduce your times required to run uh, scripts if you're doing a lot of uh, files. Thank you.